Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to show you something really cool. This is a flyaway, also known as a Manpack VSAT satellite terminal equipped with a uh, new tech modem which allows IP transmission. This system uh, can be used for a private satellite network on KU band, geostationary satellite or it could be using or utilizing a shared or a hub, shared uh, network connection. So let's get into it guys. Uh, first of all, this is a one meter mil spec uh, auto acquiring antenna system. And it has a controller back here. It's all carbon fiber, really beautiful design. This is made by a company in Canada called Seacom right now it was just powered up so it's acquired its position as far as the GPS it knows where it's located on the planet and uh, in a few minutes I'm going to have it acquire a particular satellite first we're gonna try 61 degrees and then we're gonna go over to 91 degrees uh, so it's triple axis it can do elevation and azimuth and it can also automatically adjust the skew. And this thick rubber tube coming out of the back, this is the waveguide, which is going over into what we call the buck box. There is the buck in there. It is a 65 watt buck, which is quite a lot of power for a uh, KU band system. Um, that allows us to transmit up to 20 megabits per second. That is on the uplink going up to the satellite uh, we'll get into that in a few minutes. In the top box, we have the modem inside there, you can see, and uh, a couple different power supplies. So I'll go around and show you the front here. We have the control switches, the main power. There is also the VoIP and uh, the buck, power for the buck, which I just showed you. And uh, inside here there is uh, ATA generating two telephone lines and over here there's the modem and uh, network connections for your own internet equipment and one of them is obviously utilized by the VoIP adapter over here these two connections the red one is the transmit signal which is going to the buck these are what we call our L band signals and the white one is the downlink that one is coming from the LNB, which is on the back, that white LNB on the back of the, uh, the antenna. So, that's pretty much it with uh, what we got going on right here. Um, the New Tech Modem, this is a, a favorite of news organizations because uh, it works with the New Tech Dialogue system. Uh, it's very good for video streaming and uh, yeah, going back to the VoIP adapter, two phone lines, which um, as for you news guys, you can use one line as a direct link to your newsroom or your news editor, and the other one is always open and can be used for uh, your IFB. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to get it and push this button here, and the antenna is now going to look for 61 degree satellite, which, there she goes. It's really cool, this antenna. We actually just had it in at Seacom for servicing. They did some work on the motors. Uh, it is back to perfect operation, brand new. And it is scanning the sky right now. Okay, so I'm telling it to go back to 61 degrees, which it's doing right now. And should be able to find that one. It was already on it. Looks like it's found it. 
Let's go over and look. Yes, we have a lock. Excellent. Nice signal too. Very good guys. That's excellent. So there you go guys. That's uh, how the system auto acquires. So there you go guys. Let's take another close up view of the control console. Uh, we got our main power switch for our VoIP. We got our buck here. I will turn the power onto the buck just momentarily. And you can hear the buck is uh, operational. Bucks are uh, quite noisy because they need a lot of cooling when they're transmitting 65 watts at 14 gigahertz. Yeah, that's pretty high frequency stuff when you uplink to a satellite. So there you go, guys. You got your L and B receive, your buck transmit connections. These are your network ports. And we got our VoIP adapter down here and our power control switches. And uh, everything is controlled over here. Uh, our controller, let's, uh, let's find the satellite again. There we go. And the antenna is gonna go into an auto acquire mode. Look for that 61 degree satellite. There she is. That's how it fine tunes there at the end. We're precisely locked now to the satellite at 61 degrees. So, okay. So this system is actually up for sale. If you are a broadcaster, a media company, um, an NGO, a military, a government, and you're interested in a flyaway one meter mil spec Fly, uh, VSAT system, let us know, and I'll pass on that, uh, pass you over to the co company that actually owns this. And uh, okay, guys, thank you very much.